the president told Al Sharpton, you make sure those people down there acting a fool in Ferguson, the president. Ho, oh, hey. No, the president, I said the president of the United States of America is advocating that the protesters in Ferguson stay on course. What the hell does that mean? I'm your host, the doctor of common sense, E.T. Williams. Please visit the website at www.whateverhappentocommonsense.com. I'm looking for you, girl, common sense. It's so rare. It's, it's a rare commodity in our day in society. But the president of the United States of America has told Al Sharp, stop calling him reverend, just for the love of God. It's an embarrassment for that man to have a reverend in front of his name. Just because his uh, greasy granny told him he was supposed to be a preacher because he ran his fat mouth all the time doesn't make any difference to me. But we have the president of the United States. You remember after they lost the midterms on November the 4th, on November the 5th, you remember when Al Sharpton said, I met with the president, the president wanted to talk to me. In other words, after they took that shellacking on the 4th, Barack Obama made that phone call and said, Al, get on down here. We finna act a fool. We're going to turn this mother out in Ferguson. Make these crackers pay. Click. The president of the name your time that the president of the United States was advocating that the protesters act like this. The president is acting. Don't try to dress it up trying to say what he was saying. It ain't nothing else he can be saying because they ain't been peaceful. They've been acting a fool down there. Al Sharpton says, I met, I met with the president on October the 5th, and he told me to make sure the protests stay on course. Now, how are you going to interpret that? Stay on course. In other words, break out some more windows, rob some more people, run into business, act a fool continuously. And when it get quiet down there, y'all crank up the music about 2 a.m. in the morning. Hey, 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 no, 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 no. Y'all ain't got too quiet down there. Barack Obama said we lost the election on the November the 4th. Al, get to the White House, boy. I need you to get out there, Kunta Kente, out there and make them people act a fool. Get one of those fiery speeches about cracker this, cracker that, and Jew this, Jew that. Get one of those speeches up. Yeah, I need them fired up and pissed off. Tell them I was going to give them some more phones and some more free things if they act a fool. That's right, the president. No, no, not Joe Bo on the corner. The president of the United States met with Al Sharpton. Now, many at first said that he was meeting with Al Sharpton because Al Sharpton was going to tell him how to deal with the GOP. Yeah, there's a better chance on a jackass giving brain surgery than, than uh, 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 getting good advice from Al Sharpton, who is a jackass. He ain't the, he's a two-legged jackass. Four-legged jackass can give surgery uh, better than, than uh, Al Sharpton can actually consult you on the right things to do. But he said he spoke with the president, and the president, now this is his word, but I'm going to interpret it for you. Because whenever the liberals say something, they don't mean what they say anyway. He said, I want to make sure everything was on course. And Sharpton says about his president, he was concerned about Ferguson staying on course. I don't understand what he means about Ferguson staying on course. What course have they been on? They've been riding. They've been asking for uh, uh, the officer to be arrested before they even get a trial. So tearing up businesses, protesting. Kicking police cars? What do you mean stay on course? I don't even know what that means because your idea was they talking about staying on course. All they've been doing is inst instigating themselves in violence. Even Michael Brown's mama went down there and jumped on grandma over there selling shirts and stuff. She took June Bug and them down there, jumped on and said, you ain't going to be selling nothing up in there. What? Put the pipe upside your head. And you said that the president of the United States of America, name your time that the president was instigating this. He is throwing his hat in. I know he sent Eric Holder down there. 
I mean, Eric Holder is the DOJ supposed to be having justice too. But this is the president of the United States of America saying he wanted to make sure that they were staying on course. What course have they been on? That's the only course. No matter. He can't even with one thing because the only course they've been going on is the violence, advocating violence. They're over at the UN trying to get the UN to come over to make sure they stop these crackers from shooting these, these little black boys, little innocent lambs like the apostle uh, Mike Brown. So what they possibly can be advocating if you said the president says stay on course. Name me some good things came down off in Ferguson since they've been protesting. He says stay on course. The course has been breaking in stores, tearing up crap, burning down stuff. Stay on course. I don't even know what that means. Unless you're advocating stay on course because I'm mad because we lost. Let's tab some shit. That's the only thing I can understand he possibly be saying when he says stay on course. What else could he be advocating? This is the president of the United States. Did he understand that Sheila Jackson Lee has, has volunteered to set herself on fire? As a matter of fact, since in honor of Sheila Jackson Lee, since she's going to set herself on fire, I got another fire song for you. You're going to love this one, Sheila Jackson Lee. Is Sheila Jackson Lee going down to Ferguson? Because she can go down to Ferguson and set herself on fire. You ain't got to work to try to be struggling with the president, Sheila Jackson Lee. Let it burn. The roof, the roof is on fire. We don't need no water. Lap thump. What? Burn, motherfucker. Burn. Oh, yeah, the roof. The roof. <laughs> the roof is on fire. Don't put it out. If Sheila Jackson Lee set herself on fire and want somebody trying to, I will shoot you trying to put her out. You let that heifer burn. She said she wanted to burn, damn it. Anybody else want to get burned up for the president? I mean, we can start a whole movement. As a matter of fact, we can get a whole line going like a soul train line, set you on fire, just let you just burn. Hell no, we ain't putting it out. Wish a firefighter would come up here and pull it out. We'll shoot him. I ain't no firefighter, but no damn fire. Heifer want to burn, let her burn. Damn it. Anybody else want uh, uh, Nancy Pelosi? You like to burn? It'd be easy to set you on fire. That plastic face of yours. Just saying. I mean, I don't understand. But the president has advocated. No, no. The, the president of the United States has told Al Sharpton. Who can be more honorable than Al Sharpton? Because all he does is like Robin Hood. They're fighting for the poor. And the down tried Al Sharpton here. Al Sharpton said, if you Negroes get quiet down here one more time, when they get that verdict, you better act a fool up in here. No, 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 no. The president, I got the okay from the president. They said the National Guard is headed down. Got the okay from the president. And the okay from the president says, I am going to make sure you are on course. Mr. President, what does that mean? You know, damn well, I mean, you tap some crap down there. They try to get quiet, you tear it up. And then when they get out, you start tearing up, start with some music playing. No, no, you need to play music after they tear it up. Hey. No, 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 they says, they says, they says, he says when they start trying to get quiet, I want them on course. The course was we tore up stores. People was getting them rim, getting them weave hair, getting them MD 2020, smoking a Fat one in in honor of the apostle, and he is saying, "You make sure you stay on course." Is what he's saying. Come on now, hey, ho, 